Hello everyone, my name is Romat and today we're going to do a Tlia jungle guide in Grandmaster or Master, I'm not sure, I'm at around 100 LP or something against a Graze without flash, so the classic Ignite, Smite, Face Rush Graves and the only things that we have to be careful that we have to be careful about, sorry for my tongue twisting, is the Darius ultimate and the Akali ultimate. So, for runes we're going to play with Dark Harvest, Cheap Shot, Eyeball Collection, I'm gonna go for Ravenous Hunter, Nimbus Cloak, Water Walking and these rune stats. Hello. Eh uh -huh. uh -huh. okay. Alright, I, I want to start at the blue. I want to start at the blue, but I'm pretty much sure that someone is going to be here. I'm going for La Ludens into Sorg Shoes, into something like Zonia, Rapidons, and we'll see after that. Do you mind? Hello? I guess I don't also have any help because she's AFK there. Yeah, well. Thank you, but you're very late to the party. All right, we're gonna see right now which uh, which path we're gonna take. I'm gonna cast W here to move him back. I'm gonna cast the Q. I'm gonna move towards this zone. I am a bit pissed that she didn't help me, but I suppose it's fine. I hope I don't lose my. Okay. Hello, Grace. Come on, come on, come on, come on. We kill him, we kill him. Okay, he's dumb. Man, you ain't it. I'm not gonna catch that. He hinted, he had flash, he could have escaped that. But at least he has teleport, but he definitely hinted that one. But okay, we got the kill, we're fine, we started there. Graves did the typical red to red to blue, which you see a lot of Graves players do. And it's fine, really. Okay, gonna get that. I, I think I will actually meet him again. Somewhere around here, I expect him. And so I'm gonna start this. I should have started E second, but I guess in the context of uh, the Grace fight, it's fine, really. I'm gonna smite it, gonna kite it a bit. Proper kiting as much as we can. Just, I'm not gonna use Q here. I'm gonna do the full combo here. I expect Graves to be bot. And, oh. Man, man, what are you doing? Flash. Have flash. I'm gonna push this. Okay, it's fine. We countered Graves again two times in a row. I'm gonna let the wave into neutral state, and I'm gonna move topside actually to get the to get the scuttle. I like the fact that Queen destroyed the Darius. Not sure how. But I want to take this and I want to move towards my bot side, towards my golems, because that's a very strong source of resources, of gold. But we started amazing, Echo played it really well there with his flash, with his E, and I think he will be fine now. I don't think we can kill, I don't think we can kill the Akali. Honestly doubt it, because she has a lot of escape tools. I don't think she, I don't recall if she even flashed. But Graves inted a lot early on, and uh, you don't have that much damage as Graves unless you actually are on top of the opponent. And I think he's used to invading straight towards the other, towards the other's champion's buff, and that's what probably cost him a lot. And I'm moving now towards the bot side if necessary. I'm actually moving towards the mid side again. I want to. I, I should probably recall though here. Ah, you're annoying. All right. I'm not gonna care about the first Drake, and I started the ranked game pretty fine. Generally, it's a bit harder than this, and I need to help mid. 
So I'm going for this, going for boots, going for control warp and oracle lens, going to wolves. And there is a dual problem here. If I gank mid and will fail to hit her, we lose. And if she makes six, we also lose. So what I think I need to do here, the best case scenario is to wait for level six, maybe play around top, maybe defuse a gang from the graves, maybe farm, farm properly. Because I think Graves will move towards top now. Yeah, I think also Darius flashed or something. Alright, I'm gonna ping that I'm going there. So I'm gonna cast my red trinket to check for words. I'm gonna move towards the side. I see no words. Okay, go, 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 go. Okay, that's real nice. And I'm gonna help her push here. Gonna steal some CS, but I don't care. Pushing is far more important. Okay, so he got the Drake, which is quite bad technically, because it's just a cloud, which is meh. So I think I'm fairly ahead at this point. And I'm glad that I actually passed the kill to the Queen, because I want her to be ahead. I want her to be as annoying as possible. Also, my blue is up. Bot is winning. That's an interesting one. Didn't expect it. Okay. Oops. I'm in a bit of an impasse here. I don't. I don't have any way to escape. Run! 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 It's fine. It's fine. She cast it all. But if you die here, it's bad. It's, it's fine if you escape. Nice! Gonna ping him. Nice man! Holy! Gonna go for boots, gonna go for bot side. And yeah, he's in a problem here. I think I can have my blue. Ah, uh, he's dead. I don't think. Yeah, I don't think he had any chance of this. And he's, he will probably go for my blue now. So we, we actually go here. Man, you, you trolled with that one. Okay. Get that. Get this. Put the vision were there to be sure and get my blow. It's fine. We didn't. We lost there because of the Akali roam. Man. Nice. I think he just maxed the ult here. I can flash over this wall if they come. I'm fine. I'm going for the bot side now. I think Graves might go for the uh, Herald. But I'm not sure how that will help him because I'm already ahead in farm. And if I get this too, if I get this wolves, rights, uh, bread and everything else. I'm just gonna push further and further ahead. And Akali has no ult, right? Akali, we, we know she has no ult. So we're just gonna take this, gonna hit it, gonna ping that he should be careful. I'm gonna go for this here. I want to get this, then I want to move towards the towards the bot ASAP, because Akali might also be going there. I don't care about the rest. Also, do we have uh, we have full tank, Maokai? Okay, so we just. I wanted to actually move towards this. Do we have a Maokai ult? I missed the combo there. Somehow I'm an idiot. I'm a maximum idiot there. Could have done much better. I think there is a blue here because we didn't see Graves. Yep, we can go for this definitely. Cast the queue. Gonna steal it, gonna go away. Okay, we see their bot. <laughs> they actually searched for me there. <laughs> I'm here, guys. I'm here, we're actually taking your tower. Okay. I'm gonna help them here as much as I can, and I'm gonna prepare my Ludens. Oops. 
Guys. That's an awful gank from them. That's an awful gank from them. And Echo also did the play there. Jesus, we nullified them in this fight. We absolutely destroyed them because Akali did that horrendous roam. Echo had teleport. It was awful from the get-go for them. From any point of strategy, that was awful. We also got the tower here. Also gonna get this vision word. There is also that, but I really don't want to do it. I really don't want to do it because they will... Uh, that's too. We can't. We can't do it now. We could have, but now it's just. I could go there to help, but there is certainly a graves that we're gonna have to fight. So I'm not. I'm not gonna. I could probably steal the Drake, but would it be worth? Because I have 300 gold bounty on top of me, and kills right now are much better. Third and fourth Drake. Yeah, sure, we can fight for it, but this one is. Pretty much pointless. So I have my Ludens. I'm gonna ping that they should be careful around here. Because there is a Graves. And we are far away from the fight. That's a bad thing. Gonna get this. I don't have enough gold for that. Uh, maybe they get Darius. It's fine that she turned around. Okay, we got him. It's fine that she turned around the Queen because. If uh, she went straight forward and Darius got a full E into multiple targets, then she wouldn't have had time to actually react. And that was a good play from the Queen. And also, why am I playing so good this... Is it this simple to play Talia? Or was I just lucky the, on the early game? I think I was very lucky on the early game, though. Because Graves played horrendous there. Should be careful here. Got a flash down there. Let's get another tower here. Okay, a bit too optimistic with that. Ah, that's fine. Okay, Darius is on the other side of the map. So we could definitely do something here, but Akali will come from the. Ah, okay, Akali's bot. We are going into some unwanted zones. It's fine. Back off. Back off. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's real good. Just Jin dying, not that big of a problem. Just me going to clear. Queen will have time to actually reach or not because she went, she goes bot now. I do have my ult. So we can do something here. And also I think I might be camped by the Akali now. So I'm just gonna do a formal queue here. To be sure. Alright, gonna farm, gonna try to create that level gap. I don't have flash, so that's one thing that we should be careful about. What you should be careful about is the Darius that's gonna come there. Cast an E, gonna cast my red trinket, gonna go towards mid because there is a Darius that's likely lurking somewhere. Okay, we know now where people are. I mean, yeah, I expected there an engage from her, but we could. We could definitely go for the tower. Could even dive him. They are taking Herald as oh they are winning, what? I'm just gonna counter jungle this. I don't care. I don't need to be on that side of the map. I want to play with my strongest team member. And I know that Akali is low HP. So this just opens up this entire jungle area for me, creating another advantage and oh boy, you can die if you're not careful. 
definitely die if you're not careful. Let's just back off. I'm just sitting here because there might be an Akali. Oh my god, that heal. Yeah, she's having Sanguine Blade. Alright. Okay, Akali's not there. So we can easily take this tower. There is a Janna. Alright, I'm running away. Back, back, back. Why, 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 why? Oh, well, we got the kill on Israel at least, but... Queen flashed for no reason there. I gave a huge shutdown. We stayed, we stood way too much. It's obviously both our fault. Ah, I'm mistaking here. This, this, and this. This is the order. This is the way. <laughs> and yeah, the mistake is that we we actually lost the Drake here. I mean, we could probably save it. We could probably save it. I adopt, even though I have alt. He should just try to delay it, or at least we should get kills, because we are all five. We're all all five, and go 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 go. Go! Had not smite so, but at least we cleared them up. They can get the they can get this mountain, but not the next one. So we should be careful on to that. Also have a stopwatch, guys. I mean, if they wouldn't be AFK, that would be nice. That they they heavily AFK there. I mean, we were fine. They were fighting no one there. Holy, I do have Zonia, but Akali can instantly kill me. That's a problem. That's a big problem. Also, I have my entire map up. So I should do a full clear around the full farm. Okay, get the tower. Please don't tint there. Yeah. This is the way we're gonna actually lose the game also. Man. Careful. Not sure why he didn't jump there. It's like he's scared or something. Get it and run away. Get it and run away. Run to the tower. Akali will come from this side. And so we should be careful. Okay, she's back mid. And I like the fact that Queen starts to win again. That's great. We could do a full clear now. Definitely do a full clear. We won that objective fight. Got the gold for it. I'm gonna steal this. Even though it's fairly tempting. Maybe they expect me here. So that's why I always cast the Q first. To check, to be sure. And I get this too. And after I get this I'm gonna recall. We should be careful just to the to the last trick. Alright, so I can go for an Oblivion Orb here, but I'm not sure I want that much. I want better a Idlisi Large Rod. Okay. It's good. It's bad. What? Why Queen is dead? Okay, okay, it's fine. Uh, we could, we could, we could, we could, we could, we could, we could do it. We could do it. Darius is both sides. 
Hit it, hit it. Till Darius reaches this, we got it for free. I have smite in 15 seconds. found the opportunity there, oh my god, really. You definitely found an easy opportunity there. Because we knew Grace and Akali are dead, they are the only problem, Starius was both sides, okay. So that's how you do, that's how you get the free Baron for your team. That's an entire level for everyone. So theoretically, we should be careful now. We should try to ping a kill. And she went that way. The only problem is that Drake is up and if they flash on us, we're gonna have some issues. Alright, that's bad enough. That's good enough. A lot of inting there. Get it. Okay, good. Akali is coming, Akali is coming, Akali is coming, Akali is coming, Akali is coming. Okay, get her. Okay, it's fine. Even if we lose her, it's fine. We get the Drake. Okay, we don't, we don't lose her. That's nice. Nice from every single angle. Ezreal ult maybe, but I don't think so. So we are doing, we are doing what we are supposed to do at this point. We are destroying their base. I can go for golems now. I want to get the the Rabadons. As you can see, I just waited for the Maokai. I just waited to for the Maokai to engage onto the onto the Darius. It doesn't matter on whom. I have enough burst with Ludens right now to kill anyone, and Darius is not a tank. So this is a good example of why Ludens might be better. Okay, that shouldn't happen. I mean, Queen killing graves like that. Okay, so I'm going for this. Okay. Double kill? Going there to actually try to stop the Akali from murdering the... Okay. Got her. Wait, I threw the auto attack. This Jana had time to shield. Nice. Real nice. Yep, yep, yep. Coming, coming. We are not really afraid. We are not really afraid of those champions. Especially with Maokai here. I have a Zonia buddy. What are you doing? I think he's just tilted at this point. Okay, let's back off. Let's back off. Yeah, he will get that. I will get Rabadons. I will not get Rabadons yet. Red. I don't have chat. Hope he gets the me memo. I don't think he will, but... <laughs> run, run, run. Okay, jump. There's nothing much you can do, but... Okay. I could have ulted to help her, I guess. And also, I would have lost a lot of... Eh, it's fine. Because Janna got the kill and we are actually losing nothing. And also echo those echo things now because he's overfed. It seems that Jin is not on this side of the map, doesn't want to so for some reason. So I'm just gonna get this clean and nice. And we're gonna move towards the mid. Still having level advantage obviously because of the insane push power this champion has. I have ult. 
so I could join any fight on the map. I also have a clear vision of Akali. So if she tries to engage here, I know I should have jumped into their freaking Darius. Should have zoned out there. I I into there. I into there. I into there. Should have uh, should have zoned out very fast after that. But they are fine. They escaped, and I think Queen. <laughs> I think Queen boom <laughs> explosion. I very much into there because the ult shouldn't be. I thought I could one shot the Darius, but the ult shouldn't be done like that, right? You should you should actually. Be aware of the insane damage that can jump on you after you jump on them. <laughs> so, and my head starts to hurt. Okay, let's just end this. Gonna sell this. Gonna go for. Yeah, Oblivion Orb is fine because everyone has heal in their team. Literally everyone. What? That's bad. That's worse, guys. Maybe, maybe we can actually snipe someone that tries to go to Baron. I want to do that. And and uh, I think Ezreal will do... No, don't, 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 don't! He just told them. Literally just told them where I am. But we can, we can work with this too. We are winning 3 versus 5. You you understand why I said don't, right? You get it. Because if you press that, you just tell just tell them, well here it's going to be a here is going to be a plant I'm here. Basically you instantly tell everyone where you are. Let's get Drake because this is mandatory and then we could go for Baron. And I think Queen is gonna catch Janna. I don't have smite. So we should be careful just to the Israel ultimate. I mean they aren't that lucky, are they? Okay, is your ultimate coming in? No? Okay, fine. We had time, we had time. Two barons, which is great. Grace finally caught up to me into the farm. But that's after I also did a lot of fights, extra fights. Look at my 21 kill participation. He has 13, uh, 11, sorry, Matt. So I'm going for this. I'm gonna sell the vision work because I don't think I'm gonna need it right now. And let me see what I can go for. I can go for a blasting wand. And I see I have some frame drops. We can definitely end now. We should because we have an overfed Echo. An overfed Leah. And even the Mauka is full tank and strong. I don't have ult. Yeah, that's not okay. Okay, that's great. Yeah, we won. We should win here. Oh my god, that ult is broken. Freaking broken ult, man. That's a freaking broken ult. Maokai is a very strong support if you play tank. I've seen this guy before, he played AP and he actually switched from AP to full tank. And I think that benefits him a lot more. So let's just end the game now. I think he actually beats Graves here. Right. <laughs> what is this? Come on, beat him. Beat him. There you go. Oh my god! So yeah, that was the Talia jungle tutorial in Grandmaster. I really hope you enjoyed it. And I might play more if he doesn't get nerfed. If he gets nerfed, jungle... Ugh. But I really enjoy it since... Uh, she has insane clear power now, and against Graves you should be decently fine. Well, he practically inted a lot, but you know. 
Against, uh, let me just open up a quick S tier list of champions. I'm sorry, you're not going to be able to see it. Let me just honor someone and let's see what S tier jungles. Okay, if you play Talia jungle, you should ban Nunu, definitely, because there is a lot of ganks from him and your team won't be able to survive. And you should be careful to the Olaf and Kha'Zix. You could also ask for a Kha'Zix gank. Hecarim is also annoying, but you could probably get away with it because you have flash and you could live. They are flaming each other for some reason. Alright, I wasn't first at damage because I went for a Ludens, but the burst is fine. And yeah, uh, let's see. So, Nunu is not doable, just ban it because this champion is insanely strong for ganks. Graves is doable, you've just seen it. Kane is doable until he goes red and becomes insufferable. All the AP, AP champions are doable. Lee Sin is meh, Kha'Zix is not so doable after level 6, Xin Zhao is impossible, so if you somehow get against it just try to dodge. Evelyn is some mm, skill matchup but she outscales you maybe, but you can outfarm her. All the tanks in rest are decent, Ivern is decent, Hecarim cut can be hard. So yeah, you have a lot of favorable matchups, or at least doable compared to the before, they are flaming each other in chat. But I still believe Sort of Landry is much more strong because I dealt very little damage compared to what I thought I could deal. Like I'm, I dealt more than Jin, more than Maokai, but less than Queen, less than Echo, and less than Graves, which is insane considering that I've been having 100% more kill participation. Anyway, guys, I really hope you enjoy these videos, and see you next time. Goodbye.